National Post Forum was launched last year and the main premise of the event is to bring the creative and the craft together. We look at bringing in panels who contain the writer, the director, the DOP um, or the editor. UK is making so much great TV at the moment, sold around the world, admired around the world and we want to celebrate that here in a fantastic venue like BAFTA um, and bring together people who aspire to be Emmy winning, Oscar winning, BAFTA winning. It's been really great to get out of my little studio bubble on an island in Scotland and come in here and mix with you know, really fantastic, talented people in the British film industry. For me particularly it's great because it's an opportunity to see how things change in the industry in the time that I've been away from it and hear what the latest things are. It's also good to hear from some of the, uh, the people behind the scenes that don't always get the glory, so the dubbing mixers, the sound engineers, the editors, and just to see where te technology's gone from that point of view. I'm a writer and I'm coming here to try and find out what producers are wanting from writers and try and get some clues as to any trends that might be going on at the moment as well. So I really want to be able to get my scripts out into the mainstream industry, take them by a producer um, and see the final results there. See my characters on the screen. It's just talking to people, meeting people, whether it's funders or content makers or actually just feeling like you're part of a wider community. And it can be quite isolating when you work on a remote island. Conversations today have been about all of everything being online and colorists complaining because they have to we-transfer files to their clients and they're in the most expensive edit suites in Soho. That's what I do all the time from my little cottage in Scotland. So you start to realize the playing field is leveling. I think for me it's about going back, taking what I've learnt and um, yeah, carrying on improving and learning really.